it's going to be scattered, so we'll deal with it. And here's the beauty here at 517. We've got some rain already this morning moving through the area. And if you've been up, maybe it's your garbage day and you're taking out the garbage, you probably noticed some wet sidewalks and driveways. And some of you are even seeing some of these showers this morning as we get a little closer in. So they're very light and it's going to be an on and off kind of thing throughout the day. So this really resembles what it will look like at times this afternoon, at times this evening. It's not like it's going to be a soaker everywhere all at once. So for trick or treat, some of you could really uh, luck out with just all treats as far as the weather goes, whereas in other spots it might be a little bit iffy at times. But here is the best part about all is that it's so mild. Temperatures right now are where we should be for highs, literally. So we're in the mid to upper 50s to near 60 this morning. And you'll see what uh, the numbers show on our almanac in just a moment. This is really, really mild. And then we're gonna climb into the 60s. So we've got that going for us. Five, 10 mile an hour winds. So those are also feeling pretty light and it's comfortable. So there you have it. I mean, the proof right here, 58 is where we should be. For the high, we should be in the low 40s this time of the day. We're hitting 67 degrees today. So by trick or treat time, temperatures will still be hovering in that low 60 range. That's nice. I mean, that really is nice. And I don't you don't need me to tell you about some cold Halloweens here in Northeast Ohio. We've had our share for sure. So regionally, we are in great company. We're seeing a lot of 50s to around 60. I mean, we're similar to what they're dealing with in Nashville and Atlanta and uh, Jackson, Mississippi this morning so nice and mild we'll add in a spooky shower here and there throughout the day just for good measure and that'll include this evening too so this morning's scenario looks like this as we go hour by hour on your national design mark forecast I will strategically stop the clock as we get closer to trick-or-treat and getting in our costumes and whatnot so here's four o'clock here's seven o'clock of course we've got the browns too and notice how scattered it is so some of you are seeing showers others not so much and that continues through eight o'clock as trick-or-treats winding down oh and then it's all the candy trades that happen so exciting on uh, our Union Home Mortgage seven day outlook tomorrow. Just an isolated shower. Overall, we are really going to be mild this week with high 60s to near 70, Dave. And that'll be nice because we've been showing off all these Halloween houses. Maybe you're going to be taking that stuff down, swapping it out for some Christmas lights. I saw some people putting up Christmas lights this past week. Yeah, we saw that as well. Yeah. yeah, we did a little tour this weekend of the Halloween lights. Oh, that's fun. A lot of good stuff out there, certainly.